हेलो एवरी वन आवर टूडेज टॉपिक फॉर डिस्कशन इज एंटी न्यूप्लास्टिक एंटीबायोटिक्स इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द क्लासिफिकेशन मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन एंड यूजेज ऑफ एंटी न्यूप्लास्टिक एंटीबायोटिक्स एलोंग विद द एस ए आर ऑफ एंथ्रासाइक्लिन एंटी कैंसर एंटीबायोटिक्स आर डिराइव फ्रॉम द स्पीसीज ऑफ स्टेप्टोमाइसिस बैक्टीरिया दीज एंटी कैंसर एंटीबायोटिक प्रिवेंट मेमेलियन सेल डिविजन but they affect dna synthesis and dna replication anti cancer antibiotics are administered almost exclusively by intravenous infusion for the treatment of lymphoma leukemia nephroblastoma sarcoma and the cancer of breast lungs stomach thyroid and testicles they can be classified in three categories of anthracyclines actinomyces and the miscellaneous drugs anthracycline consists of the doxorubicin donorubicin ipirubicin and idrubicin actinomycins consist of dactinomycin plecomycin and the miscellaneous consist of the bleomycin and metomycin coming to the anthracyclines The anthracyclines are obtained from the species of Streptomyces quaerulorubidus uh, and Streptomyces pucitus and the different drugs are tabulated this is the structure of anthracycline antibiotics which consist of a tetracycline ring structure with a sugar which is known as dinosamine which is attached by a glycosidic linkage if we consider this ring as ring a this ring as ring b this ring as ring c and this ring as ring d then the ring a b and c are known as anthraquinone ring the ring d is a hexane ring so this is a tetracycline ring system if we consider this ring as ring e then this is a oxane ring if we talk about the structures of different drug then in donorubicin there is difference at this r position r2 and r3 and r4 position so at r position there is a methoxy group at r2 there is a hydrogen at r3 there is a hydroxy group and at r4 there is a hydrogen there is only one difference in the structure of a donorubicin and doxorubicin that there is a change of hydroxy group at r4 four position at r there is same group that is the methoxy group at r2 also the groups are same that is hydrogen at r3 the groups are same that is hydroxy but at r4 in donorubicin there is hydrogen but in doxorubicin there is a hydroxy group if we talk about carminomycin that there is oh group at r position at r2 there is a hydrogen at r3 there is a hydroxy group and at r4 there is also a hydrogen so what is the difference between donorubicin and carminomycin it is only the difference of the methoxy group in donorubicin and the hydroxy group in carminomycin in idrobucin there is hydrogen at r position hydrogen at r2 position oh group at r3 position and hydrogen at r4 position in epirubicin there is a methoxy group at r position oh group at r2 position again hydrogen at r3 position and oh group at r4 position so this so this is the difference in the structure of all the drugs in this category coming to the structure activity relationship the quinone form is essential for the generation of the free radicals what is the quinone form this is the ring b which consists of two ketonic group and this is the quinone form of the anthraquinone ring 
so this quinone form is essential for the generation of the free radical the flat anthracyclinone ring system intercalate with dna the hydroxy group must be on beta position which hydroxy group the hydroxy group which is placed at r3 position this hydroxy group must be present at uh, in beta position and this amino group is important to dna binding and topo isomerase second binding so this amino group is important for the dna binding and topo isomerase second binding now coming to the mechanism of action anthracyclines exert cytotoxic action by three ways these anthracycline intercalates into dna strands and form a ternary complex secondly they inhibit the topo isomerase second enzyme which is the mechanism of most of the anthracycline the topo isomerase second enzyme is very much important because it is responsible for the resealing of the dna and thirdly there is a formation of o2 free radicals these o2 free radicals damage intracellular macromolecules such as dna bases lipid membranes and the thiol containing transport proteins what are the uses of these anthracycline antibiotics these antibiotics like doxorubicin and danorubicin is used to treat cancer specifically these are used for the treatment of acute myeloid leukemia acute lymphocytic leukemia chronic myelogenous leukemia kaposis sarcoma which is a type of cancer that can form masses in the skin lymph nodes and other organs and in the treatment of neuroblastoma neuroblastoma is a cancer of nervous tissue now coming to the second class of antibiotics that is actinomycin dactinomycin is a anti cancer antibiotic which is also known as actinomycin d and uh, these dactinomycin was isolated from the species of streptomyces parvulus and other dactinomycin belongs to the category of actinomycin which is widely used to treat a number of types of cancer dactinomycin are chromopeptides they contain chromophore phenoxazone dicarboxylic acid which is known as actinosin ring system so this is the actinosin ring system in which these three rings if we consider this ring as ring a this as ring b and this ring as c then all of these three ring a b c is known as phenoxazone ring so this is a phenoxazone ring and both of these two rings are the penta peptide lactone rings both of these rings are the penta peptide lactone rings so this actinosine ring is also known as 3 phenoxazone 19 dicarboxylic acid because there is two carboxylic acid group at 1 and 9 position so this is a 3 phenoxazone 19 dicarboxylic acid and this actinosin is responsible for yellow and uh, yellow red color of the dactinomycin the amino acids which are present in the pepta pep penta peptide lactone rings are very much important and these amino acids are the first is this is the l threonin this is d valine uh, this is l proline this is soriosin and this is l methyl valine so the sequence of the pro, uh, amino acids which are present in the penta peptide lactone ring is important so this is a actinosine ring system which is present in the actinomycin antibiotics so what is the mechanism of action the dactinomycin intercalates between the adjacent guanine and cytosine base pairs of the dna and inhibits the dna and rna synthesis 
the flat phenoxazone ring intercalates or bind to the DNA and RNA base pairs and inhibit the biosynthesis of DNA and RNA. What are the uses? The most important use of dactinomycin is in the treatment of rhabdomyosarcoma and Wilms tumor in the children. It is also used in Ewing sarcoma, osteogenic sarcoma, Kaposi's sarcoma and other solid tumor. Now coming to the third antibiotic that is bleomycin. It is a glycopeptide antineoplastic antibiotic which is isolated from Streptomyces verticillus. It is a mixture of closely related compounds of bleomycin A2 and B2. They occur naturally as blue copper chelates. Copper is removed by chemical reduction to obtain copper free white solid bleomycin. So this is a complex structure of a bleomycin which can be categorized in four parts. This is this first part is known as DNA binding domain which consists of sulfonium and the bithiazole ring. Bithiazole means there is two thiazole ring. So this part is known as the DNA binding domain and there are two possible planar orientation that is the cis orientation and the trans orientation of the two thiazole ring of the two thiazole rings in the bithiazole moiety. The second part of the structure is known as linker domain and this linker domain consists of threonin and the methyl valerate. The third part of the structure consists of the metal binding domain which consists of the beta amino alanine, the pyrimidinyl propionamine and the beta hydroxyhistidine. This pyrimidinyl propionylamine is because of the presence of this pyrimidine ring. So this is the metal binding domain. The fourth domain is the sugar domain which consists of two carbohydrate moiety. The first is the alpha L glucose and the second is alpha D mannose. So this is a complex structure of bleomycin which can be divided into four parts. The first is the DNA binding domain. The second is the linker domain. The third is the metal binding domain and the fourth is the sugar domain. And what is the difference? The difference is the difference between the A2 and B2 is the presence of R group, the presence of R group in the DNA binding domain. The R for A2 is NH CH2 whole thrice, S CH3 whole twice, and for B2, the R is NH. CH2 whole 4 NH C double bond NH NH2. So this is the difference between A2 and B2 which is in DNA binding domain. Now coming to the mechanism of action. The cytotoxic properties of bleomycin are due to the cleavage of DNA strands. Bleomycin causes season of the DNA by intercalating with the molecular oxygen and ferrous iron. It binds to the DNA and form complex and generate free radical. These free radical res are responsible for the season of the DNA chain. What are the uses? It is used for the treatment of tumors of testes and ovary. In testicular cancer, it is used with cisplatin and vinplastin. It is used in the treatment of squamous cell uh, carcinomas of the head, neck, esophagus, skin and the genitourinary tract which includes the penis, scrotum, cervix and vulva. So this is all about the anti-neoplastic antibiotics. If you like this video, please do subscribe my channel and share with your friends. Thank you for your time.